Thanks for joining us today at Island Ford Superstore located on Norcross Road in Duncan, BC off the Trans-Canada Highway. We're in the Cowichan Valley on Vancouver Island. Today we're looking at a 2017 Explorer Limited in ingot silver. It has black leather interior, seating for seven, four doors and a hatch. It's got a 2.3 litre four-cylinder all-wheel drive flex fuel engine. It also has a class 3 trailer tow package. It's really easy to get into this vehicle. Just talk to our sales team. They'd be happy to take you out on a test drive. Storage and speaker in the door as well as power locks, windows and mirrors. The driver's seat also has memory. The driver's seat is powered with massaging seats and also has lumbar your lift gate release, tow, lighting controls. You have power pedals as well as power tilt and telescoping for the steering wheel. On the face of the steering wheel, you have dash controls, cruise control, sync voice activated system with volume. This is a push start, so the key's in my pocket, puts on the brake, and we're gonna push the engine start button. On the dash, we're gonna see two menus that come up as well as any important messages and we can toggle through we'll toggle through to the left first display mode trip one and two fuel economy driver assist settings and these all have sub menus you're seeing the car there in the dotted lines and that's your lane keeping on the right is entertainment navigation and phone and you notice that they change color in the center, you have a couple of air vents as well as a display screen. That's a touch screen. So we go into audio and your sources, AM, FM, Sirius Radio, CD, and Bluetooth. You've also got navigation. And when you put your vehicle in reverse, this is where you're gonna see your backup camera view. You have your settings, which you can slide through and choose, such as ambient lighting. And in your climate, you will see your heated steering wheel as well as the controls for those uh, driver and passenger seat because you've got dual climate control. You've also got your camera, park assist, parking sensors, hazard lights, and there's your CD player. Below that is your front and rear defrost and you've got cooled and heated seats for both driver and passenger so you can control it on the screen or on the panel here. You've also got your AC and max AC and down below in the little cubby you've got a USB and 12 volt. You've got an automatic shifter and as well you've got your terrain management system. So as you dial through this you're going to see it on the dash and it's going to appear there to the left mud rut. The next one is sand mode and then you've got snow gravel grass as well and then you can just dial back through to normal. You've also got your hill descent in the center there. A couple of cup holders and your armrest opens right up. Inside you've got storage as well as a 12 volt outlet. Off to the side is your glove compartment and up above is an a me, uh, sorry, an auto dimming rear view mirror, universal garage door opener, lighting controls, sunglass holder, and this will actually tilt and slide that moonroof for you. 20 inch wheels, mud flaps, chrome door handle with intelligent access and keyless entry keypad. The back hatch has a spoiler as well as a windshield wiper and your backup camera is located just below that Explorer splash. You have backup sensors on your bumper, dual exhaust, and when you're ready to open up that hatch, you can do so from inside. You can double click your fob or you can give it a bit of a kick. It powers it open for you and inside, I've got one seat up and one down. You can see that you've got your extra carpeted mats as well as all weather mats and as well a cargo net. And you've also got some hooks to be able to tether things. Your speakers are off to the side there. And then you have the controls on the left hand side that allow you to fold, stow, or set the seats up as normal. You've also got a 12 volt and a light located there. And when you're ready to close everything up, you have a handle up to the right. You can power it down pushing the button or you can give it a bit of a kick. It'll chime for you to let you know that it's going down securely and then you can lock it up and walk away or jump in and head out on your latest adventure. On your fob, you also have remote start. Storage and speaker in the door as well as power windows and wood grain inlay. You have seating for three in this row with a 60-40 split. I brought down the headrest by pushing the button and at the base you just pull the lever, it'll bring the seat right down and then pull it again and it'll pop it right out of the way. You now have access to those two back seats in a 50-50 split and you're also seeing extra all-weather mats as well as carpeted mats. You've got a bin off to the side with cup holders and when you're ready to put everything back in place, simply push the seat down with one hand 
hand, lift it up, and pop up the headrest. In the center, you've got an armrest with a couple of cup holders, slim pockets on the back of the front seat for extra storage. In the center, you've got a couple of cup holders, USB and 110 outlet, air climate control, as well as heated seat controls, grab handle in the body, hooks, handles, lighting, venting, and that panoramic view up above. Passenger side, caplets, easy fuel gas filler, privacy glass in the back windows with window vents, roof rails, heated and powered side view mirrors with blind spot information system, LED headlights, fog lights, and so many more reasons to visit us at Island Ford Superstore, BC's number one rated Ford dealer.